didn't make it out alive. And a journalist was there as well who didn't make it out alive. And let's talk about the moment that changed your life forever. And that day. We were out, we were filming in an abandoned village just outside Kyiv. The Russians had almost surrounded the city and the idea was they would take it in the next few days. We actually ironically weren't planning on going up to the front lines. We were filming these areas that had been totally demolished and we saw schools that had been hit, churches that had been hit and we filmed this all ourselves. And as we'd finished, we were driving back towards the capital city of Kyiv. Hadn't seen anyone in a long time. And we slowed down an abandoned checkpoint. And out of nowhere, the first missile came out of nowhere. <laughs> Man's about 30 feet in front of us. Mm -hmm. Immediately, Pierre shouts, reverse the car, reverse the car. There were two Ukrainians driving as well. There were five of us in the car. The car got stuck. We couldn't go back. And Pierre shouted, get out of the car. Everyone get out of the car. And the next second, the second bomb hits pew, right in front of the left of the car. And that one, I went black. And I, I was in a dark place. I couldn't feel or see. Um, and I'd taken some shrapnel in the eye and I, a matchbox size shrapnel in my, in my neck and I was, I was out, I was out dead. And then I saw my, my daughter out of nowhere into this blackness right in front of me came my daughter Rona and she said to me, Daddy, you've got to get out of the car. Real as if she was in front of me, out of nowhere she came to me. And I came to and I opened up my eyes and my instinct took me towards the car door and I scrambled, I pulled myself out and I got out of the car and the third bomb hit the car itself right after that. Next thing I know I wake up, it's thrown me away, I'm on fire, my right leg is gone. I'm, I roll around, I try to put the... And you, that, uh, you had lost your foot at that point. I'd lost the foot, um, yeah. the foot had gone. I, ironically, I didn't notice it at the time. And so then your eye is injured and, and yeah. every, you're bleeding, bleeding everywhere. Eye. They took pieces out of my, of my skull out. Uh, my left hand, which has been put back together, was all torn up, the thumb hanging off. So um, 